sexy music for you in honor of Valentine's Day. Which made us wonder, what is it that attracts us to one person and not another? This morning we are revealing the chemistry of love on The Early Show. I'm Eric Hill. Good morning. That's right. <laughs> We're bringing the volume way down. Way but the down. heat is going up. <laughs> it's getting a little hot in here. <laughs> Hi, everybody. I'm Chris Rankin. <laughs> We're getting totally carried away. Also ahead the next half hour, yeah, the secret <laughs> to flower power. Tricks to keep that bouquet blooming long after Valentine's Day. Did you know that this song, though, Let's Get It On, Marvin Gaye, yeah. only apparently, according to Billboard magazine, the fifth sexiest song of all time. The sexiest was Physical by Olivia Newton. It's an aerobic song, people. No, it doesn't work for me. Exactly. I picture the headband, the 80s leg warmers. Sweating to the old, I mean, <laughs> uh, whatever. Not that the 80s Bring that Richard old. Simmons into it now. <laughs> Boy, there's a lot going on. I think maybe it's time for a little check of the news. We'll get to all that in just a moment. We do want to get you caught up, though, on the morning's headlines. Elaine Quijano standing by at the news desk. And welcome to the family. Good to have you with us. Thank you. Good morning, everyone. There could be another delay before the release of 10 Americans accused of child trafficking in Haiti. The New York Times Cafe. So don't go anywhere. We'll be right back. There's so much time. There we go. So it is Valentine's Day, as we mentioned. We're talking a lot about love this morning. Yeah. I don't think you can talk about Valentine's Day without the sweetheart candy, right? Yeah, it's a sure sign that Valentine's Day is here when you see these things all over the place. Don't you and notice they're a lot littler than they used to be? You think so? It's the recession. It yeah, I think everything. it must be. The box is but they're, but the they're more relevant. For example, Eric, it says, look over your shoulder, your car is being towed. <laughs> That's pretty they, cool. But they are more relevant. They actually they have some new sayings this yeah. year. They have new flavors for the first time in what, 175 years? 45 years. 145 years. They've been around for 145 years. Which I well, who realized. Hasn't? Surpri <laughs> surprising though. I was shocked to find that out. I was. You can now you can now get them with ones that say tweet me. <laughs> tweet and you know how much I love Twitter, Chris. <laughs> you know that's totally for me. <laughs> Text me that's is another totally one. You've got you rock, mm -hmm. which is something that uh, they that didn't have before. Chris says to me every Saturday. <laughs> a sweet, sweet oh, listen beat. to this one. We're at the I'm sorry, it's upside down. <laughs> uh, hug me. That's not new. I think that's an old one. Love bug is apparent. I, I call love my son bug. love bug, but I didn't realize that was a new one. I kind of thought it would be there yeah, for a while. Yeah. Adore me. Do you remember that one? Is the, no, it was, oh, was it adore me? I thought it was a doormat. I didn't uh -huh. understand. It. <laughs> but the, the, I mean, that's the day a after bold. Valentine's Day well, that that part starts. Bold. Here's one. What does that say? You are hot. Oh, just the U and the R, like you, you would text it. Oh, you got it. Not bad. Oh, so the flavors good. are new, too. I actually haven't they tried these. They are pretty tasty. They're supposed to be more flavorful. It's amazing that it took 145 oh. years to get sugar to taste a different way. <laughs> Isn't it, though? If you, if you like the old ones, apparently you can still find them in dollar stores. Kids at home, flavor. save your teeth. Apples. Wow. <laughs>